This is Soft Daddy and you're watching Beat Evolution TV. I moved to Sydney one year ago just because of uh, life reasons, you know, get a change of, of the air and um, my girl had a job offer in Sydney so we said let's try and uh, move out of Germany which was a pretty good uh, experience but as you can see I'm back and uh, for a good reason and you know because Australia is a really nice country and I love the environment, uh, the nature is crazy and I've seen the best beaches I've ever seen in my life. I've seen koalas and whales and spiders and you cannot imagine but for me the music scene is so important and um, especially here in Berlin the, the music scene is crazy. Um, uh, an event like Beat Geeks which we have every second Tuesday in the month um, is not possible in Australia because there are not enough people who are in it. So into it. So, you know, I kind of miss the spirit and the vibe of Berlin and uh, I have much more work to do here. So I decided to come back and say hey. Yeah, that would be the, the most um, special memories are about the nature. You know, I took a trip to Great, Great Barrier Reef and snorkeled and, uh, you know, seen so long beaches, 10 kilometers of beach where nobody is and the best sea and you know Australia is all about the nature so you know that's something that you don't have here in Germany um, this kind of of different different nature sites which is crazy but when it comes to to the urban um, way of life you know I don't know it's too British for me Yeah, I have this project with Dexter and Brank and uh, we call ourselves the Betty Ford Boys. And uh, this plan is, you know, uh, is around for two years now and one year ago we said, all right, let's finally start the whole project. And so while I was in Sydney, I was working on the, on the Betty Ford Boys LP, which is basically an instrumental LP where Dexter, Brank and myself, we exchange stems of our beats and the other one adds a bass line or some drums or whatnot, so we kind of work on the beats together. Some we do on our own, some we do together. And so we did the, um, the album, it's called The Leaders of the Brew School, and um, I finished that project in, in Sydney, but due to some uh, label politic reasons, um, we will put it out on August the 13th. And uh, yeah, when I come back, so we, we started the Betty Ford Boys promo tour, which means we were on tour two weeks um, with um, apparently Dexter and Brank and Robert Winter, our photographer from Melting Pot Music. And um, yeah, we played eight shows and did a bunch of interviews and uh, was a whole success. People liked it, people liked the record. For our tour, we produced an exclusive 10 inch record, which was only available on the tour. So whoever doesn't have it you won't get it anywhere else you know it's it's done but this was a great record as well <clears throat> and um, but this was just the start of the whole Betty Ford Boys project because uh, we plan to work together for several albums several years maybe our whole life and um, yeah you will hear the, the, the record in August it, it's a little bit to go we perform like we put a bunch of equipment on the stage, stand together in a line and, you know, bang out our most, our best songs, you know, one by one. And, you know, make some transitions and whatnot, but it's all about playing some new Betty Ford Boy stuff and then playing some classics. We do a mixture, you know, some uh, banging stuff. I, I perform some songs which are kind of slow because I'm the dude who plays a lot of slow shit. And um, 
yeah, that's kind of it. You know, like no show is is similar. It's a little bit like a like a DJ set with us us three, but we 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 are working on the beats a little bit. You know, I can't explain. You have to, you have to to watch it. Uh, the next thing is. Um, because the real album is not out yet, you know, um, but it's finished, I will work on some uh, solo stuff again. It will be another Soft Daddy instrumental LP, which doesn't have a name or, or um, theme or anything to it yet, because I haven't even worked on it yet. Because, you know, when I came back from Australia, I was so busy with, with playing gigs and, you know, getting back into my life that I wasn't working on too much stuff. But I was working on a few remixes and I've uh, been working with uh, Zonara, a dude from uh, Erfurt, MC, which was kind of cool. And um, so I don't know, but it will be, we, are, we will all continue to do our solo projects, but you know, once a year there will be a Betty Ford Boys album. So, yeah. And for the next, uh, sorry, and for the next album, you know, we, we are thinking about, um, we're just renting a house in the, in the Schwarzwald, Black Forest and just kick it for three weeks and you know and that time we produce the next record like totally together without internet and whatnot. <laughs> Yeah, we are starting a Beat Geek 7 inch series uh, at the moment. The first two will be out this summer, I guess. And um, I did a 7 inch with Figo Bratlovic. And there's another 7 inch with Dexter and Cutmaster Kurt. And this is, you know, Beat Geeks, our event represents the instru instrumental stuff. And so we thought about why don't we put out beats ourselves because, you know, all the good producers from all around Germany or Europe or even, you know, some people from New Zealand been to our party and, you know, we are kind of this collective so we thought about let's, let's get some stuff out there so um, this will be out soon and um, will be a lovely series, I guess. Yeah, and besides the 7 inch series, um, we started, um, last year we started the Beat, Geek, Beat Geeks weekend special Unfortunately, I couldn't be there last year, but this year it will be happening again in November and um, from what I've heard so far, it will be a really good weekend, so I'm looking forward to that. More info is coming soon. Stay tuned. Yeah, I'm, I'm, happy about, uh, I'm happy about Beat Geeks. I'm happy about continuing to work with Hazim and the Bob and, you know, this event really, really gives me a lot of good energy, so, you know, we work on making it better and making it staying alive. Peace. <laughs>